again, it's part three of my video. If you've not seen the previous two parts, they'll be linked in the description below. I suggest you go and watch them before you watch this to sort of get what's going on. But without further ado, let's get into it. We have just picked up where we left off, uh, uh, where we raided the compound. And now it's telling me to go to Lizzie's bar, but to be honest, I want to find a shop before I do that, can I? If you don't see this bit, I'll probably cut it. But I'll all be do it. If you don't see it, I'll I'll see you at Lizzie's bar. Right, we're back, everyone. I just sold a load of junk and weapons and stuff that I wasn't going to use because it was too low power. And we're back at Lizzie's. I think we've got 10,000 in the bank. Yeah, I think we've got 11,000 in the bank now. So, Looking could help us out a bit. Put out there, input. Interest you in a pre BD? Sure. Hold it, house rules first. There will be severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I bring you a greet. That's my thought. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun, input. Welcome to Lizzie's. I might have to blur all this out, yeah. So far, nothing screwed. Hey. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here. Tell me where she I'm is. Asking. Name's V. She and I have a... Uh, Date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. Mateo. Uh huh. So, Evelyn? Love's big. Gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's alright, Mateo. Dick. Evelyn Parker. Coincidence. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Why not say hello soon? I wanted to get a good look at you first. Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. You do. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. That's how she runs the place, man. So, uh, no. what can a Nothing girl wrong. like me really? Why don't you just tell me the truth? I tell just me. told you. She looks like a stripper. Hey, no smoking inside. That's not. Her. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. I'm good at what I do. Got a solid crew on my back, too. Never once botched a job. You do realize I expect more of you than scraping street corner data terms. Much, much more. Good for I'm you. the best, and I know what I'm getting into. Dex was clear. The job's high risk. 
By the way, you work together long? You and Dex? Just started working with him, in fact. I've heard there are two kinds of fixers. Those with stable crews on long contracts and short leashes. Loyalty and predictability they value above all else. Then there's the other kind. Dex's kind. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Nope. Classy Corp hotels? Yeah, no. Out of my price range. Hmm. Well, the decor's to die for. As you'll see for yourself. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. Wow. What? So Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Tell me you're one of them? Make sure it's like Catwoman with them claws. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently right. swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is... You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. I'll kill him. Follow me. Oh. I got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? New facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits. Jacking off too in those boxes. Like anything else? No. That's how it is. It can be a very useful it. tool. Good for no. analyzing no. details, human per Why? So what's on the tape? I didn't mean to do that. Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? No, not at all. Let's see this brain dance. Come on, get on with it. Drag it out, woman. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox. Not the latest member of your crew. Try not. So, you'll be a good boy, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Biz or life. Oh, it's an animus. You've ripped off Assassin's Creed. Hey, there you are. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Good for her. Come here, Judy. Hey, Judy. <laughs> Compiled your BD yet? What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw. 
But yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. It's not being an anonymous again. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dead. Ever taken a dip before? Wasn't me. Think I can handle it. Let's just do this. Righto. Yeah, Sit righto. Down. Settle in, and we'll get you going. Is it animals? I'm telling you. Promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at so it's going to hurt me every other time. Run the analysis Crazy lady. Should feel a slight tingle. Mm -hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend That's it's your eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what we be analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. I need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we... Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So yeah, we don't waste our time. Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. As you get your bearings, then we'll jump into editing. Be diving in and three. It's not even really, bro. simple do nothing odd don't get creative you go in snatch the cash get out and we'll okay crazy man. to go cycle freaks for the studio got it got it and remember everything on full blast they'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high okay on you go gang sheet Everybody, on the ground, what I see you kissing the foreign money now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God. Whoa, yeah, hey, uh, uh, now, before I blow your fucking head off. Give me all your money, motherfucker. Ah! Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. That flash of intense shock. I can still feel it, I remember. Fuck, that last second. Your lady friend is crazy. Could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. And I hope that about 50 hours on this game. You'll be fine. Got everything set up. Let's switch over to editing mode. Okay, I'll try. I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Full seems yours. Full cam control in analysis mode. So move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sample. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. 
Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Crazy, no, huh? that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Yeah, I rewind. Got it. Roll it back to the top. All good, neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Flat simple. Do nothing off the creep. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you mm -hmm. get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Plan, simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creepy. You don't need to touch my hand. Yeah. Everything on full left. That's why I measure. Okay, on you. Okay, right here. Excellent. Let's move on. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Well, that's not. Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously. Like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? We have a deal today of two flavors. Cuddy and yeah. surf and Everybody! Huh? Visual layer. Switch layer. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller is cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared. Meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hello, nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. On the ground! You wanna see a kiss in the fall, Mike? Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. Alright, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. That Oh, bro, fucking drop your shotgun! What's your face now? Come on, look! Jeez. I think that's his mate now. See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind Whoa. the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. His own chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. What the hell? Anyway, if you've seen these, enough, man. you can exit. There we go. Bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? No way. Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when. Oh, he 
Yeah. I think I'm done. That was a quick break. Wait, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Bug to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Running for my crew. Security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Oh. Not what we agreed, Ev. Relax, Judy. Everything will be fine. You don't quite grasp the risks I took by letting you in here while I'm risking poking around with this stuff. We're all taking risks here. That's the job. So either T-Bug patches in or I'm on my way out. Ooh, Sasa. Judy, please. Fine. Call her. Let's get this over with. Sassy Lasse. Hey V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compeki? Oh, I thought as much. Someone there with you? Judy and Evelyn, they're chill. They helped me work through this BD. Yeah, the chill, uh -huh. man. Alright. You gonna tell me what this is about? Listen, need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? I'm millisec. Well, if I didn't want to okay. it. connection confirmed. Well, if I didn't want to do it in the first place. Ice and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. Yeah, Judy, fire up. Sassy lassie. <laughs> Alright, me, eyes open. Gotta find out where your nose was keeping the relic. You look like a cut of fuckable meat. Oh, oh no, the guy. She. I felt a fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said, no. They'll have my head for this. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to... Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. How do you do it now? Somehow. No, just the price. Go back to the main box, start talking, and read the same. enough. Stop it, Dimitri. So I'm doing this just so I can watch the whole recording from Evelyn's point of view. I can just rewind it then. Oh, fuck. It's like I'm really. Now I can do it. You look I've no habit for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. We shall see soon enough. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's involved. a tired, visionless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. We'll listen to. Saburo is an adult despot 
utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world crazy, that man. no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no. provide them. You know. Heard that? Relic docs gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Here in a drone, ventilation and cooling, servers, gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. Mm. They are, no? Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Manual details a special tip controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Hmm. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. That sounds all creepy though. Yeah. I missed it because I'm an idiot. On your data, you were never here. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling VDs. 
I already uploaded your calibration settings. You're a genius. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Cheers for eagle vision. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Judy, relax. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Anger. Wasn't bad clothes as well. Let's walk. Well, what do you think? So, what now? V, do this job for me. I mean, me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. Hmm. I'll I agree. There'll be hell to pay for sure. I know. Whatever you decide, it stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. <sighs> Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. Ooh, do we betray him? Don't we? What do we do? Do we betray him? things looking, Mr. V. Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Mm -hmm. Said she's working her magic. Yeah, yeah, I'll see ya. I don't know. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? All right, Mom. Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Mr. V. Ooh, what do we do? I guess we'll find out in the next video because I'm going to leave it here for today. So, uh, if you enjoyed, don't forget to click the like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.